Hey guys, today we're gonna be playing Naruto. I can't read it, but it says something about Striker, but um, yeah. Uh, uh, lobby action. Okay. Okay. Uh, whatever. So let's try going to. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. I don't want cereal. No, I don't want cereal. No holding no back. back. Okay. okay, let's start, let's start with, the with the basics. First, First comes, comes movement. movement. Try, moving Try moving over, over towards, towards me. me. Okay, I right, done movement. So. Next, Next is, wall is wall running. running. Try, running Try running up that up cliff. That cliff. <laughs> if you if run you straight run toward it, it, you'll be able you'll to be able run up the side of it. Of it. Well, I already kind of did that. <laughs> Good. Good. Looks, like Looks like you know, like how, you to know how to control your chakra, your chakra properly. properly. Now I'll now tell I'll you tell about you chakra, chakra jumps. jumps. You can use you can those to jump even farther distances. Oh, okay, this is... You press, um, square to... <laughs> yeah, yeah, you press square to attack, I guess. And... What do, um, try to do? Oh, it does some, like, some heavy attack. <laughs> okay, oh, holy crap. Okay, okay. Just use a wire kuna. You can use a recovery if it seems like you're gonna fall off the cliff. So don't forget. Alright, next, I'm gonna teach you how to attack. Alright, try attacking your opponent now. The key to attacking attack is to always keep an eye on your opponent. And on the battlefield, losing sight of your opponent is akin to suicide. Always, always keep, keep this in mind. mind. Throwing Kuna is a good way to hit far away enemies. Now. You'll need to You'll protect, need to protect your, body your body when your enemy attacks. Do this, Do this by guarding. By guarding. Guard, Guard in order to withstand your opponent's you attacks yeah. and create openings. Yeah. Now, you should know that you also have the ability to deflect enemy attacks while guarding. Don't forget to predict your opponent's moves and dodge when you can. <laughs> If there's not enough time to guard or dodge, remember that you can always just use a substitution jutsu. After using the jutsu, you can take a moment to think and plan your counterattack. Okay. Then slap. Okay. 
Let's continue our training. Ninjutsu. Okay. As you probably know, ninjutsu can be activated by channeling chakra. The effects of each jutsu widely vary. Some jutsu are made for dealing damage. Okay. While others can be used to impair opponent's abilities or to freeze them in place. Finding a jutsu that best fits your own fighting style is the key to attaining victory. Aside from basic ninjutsu, we also have secret techniques. In order to activate a secret technique, one needs a large amount of chakra. But be aware that these techniques are much stronger than normal ninjutsu. Use your chakra, wait for the right time, then aim and fire. Well, that's it for basic training. Now, just don't forget to practice. Good work, and keep on doing your best. That's actually pretty good. Don't forget to subscribe to me, and um, I can't do anything else, so bye. I said...